What do you do when you have 29 inputs that are coming from your stage rack, but then you have these three that you want coming from the local console here? Make sure you're updated to at least version four. Press routing and then tab all the way over until you get to user. We then take our first input and select where it's coming from. In this case, we are AESA1 and follow this for the rest of your inputs. On our last three inputs, we want this coming from local. So on 30, we're going to select local in one, two, three. After you've done that, page back all the way over to inputs and we're going to select user in one through 32. Don't forget to also update your expansion card inputs user in one through 32. And just like that, we have all of our 29 inputs coming from our AESA. And then we have these three inputs coming from local. So next time you're setting up the X32, utilize the user routing to get more flexible with your routing.